Sometimes a receipt from a customer is going to be for more than one sales invoice. In this video, I'll show you how you match that receipt to multiple sales invoices. Okay, from the dashboard, we're going to our bank reconciliation. So we click on the reconcile and we're looking for a receipt. So we scroll down, we look in the received column and we come to £480 receipt from AAA. Now life would just be too straightforward if Zero was able to match that to one invoice. If there had been one invoice, we know that Zero would match it and on the right hand side it would be green. But in this instance, it's more than one invoice that AAA have paid. I actually know that it's two invoices. So there's not an automatic match. What do we do? We go to the right and we need to click on find and match. When we click on find and match, Zero will show us a list of all outstanding invoices that could be paid. Now, because it's a demo company I'm using, it's a little bit messy. There is quite a lot there and a lot of it is actually quite old as well. So if we scroll down that list, we can actually see here are the two invoices we're interested in. AAA and AAA. £168 and £312. That makes up the £480 that they've paid. Now, it wasn't the easiest thing to find them because the list is getting long. What we could have done instead is we could go to the search box and if we type in AAA, hit click on go, there we can see it. Ignore the first two entries which again are old but we can see our two invoices and we could select them. The other thing we can do with the search box, if we remove AAA, we can actually search by amount. So if we knew the invoice was £168, that again would pick up the invoice we want. So let's go back to just searching for AAA and select the two of them. When we select the two of them, this turns green we've matched two transactions. And all we would have to do now is click on OK, or if you scroll down, you can see there's another alternative. We can click on Reconcile. But I'm also going to show you, if we untick one of those, so we've got £480, and at this stage, we've only matched one of them. Again, let's scroll down, and I'll show you what Zero does. Zero actually keeps track of how much you still need to find. So this is great if you maybe got somebody that's paying you 10 invoices, certainly much more than two. If you're trying to maybe work out what a payment is for, maybe you haven't got a remittance advice and there's a little bit of guesswork. This is great because as you make your ticks, you can see what your balance is. If we only had the second one, we can see we're out by 168. Once we are agreed, that difference disappears. And again, as we say, click on the green reconcile or back up and click on OK. So that's how you match a receipt when it relates to more than one sales invoice. If you found that useful, I would appreciate a thumbs up and why don't you subscribe to the channel so that you can get notified of our new videos as and when they appear. Until next time, happy zeroing.